day again. And there's still something happening on this road. Every day there's something happening on this road. We're definitely not lost because we're trying to wing it. Some guys just tried to help us, so hopefully we're back on the right track again after about five different changes. Still not there. Did you hear that? English translations for all the different uh, station names. So don't worry about a language barrier because it's pretty much non-existent here because they translate everything for you. <laughs> So we arrived here pretty late last night. Oh, well, well, seven o'clock. <laughs> late, really, really late. Um, we're staying at a little hotel that's got cats in it. Well, I've touched the name here because I'm not too sure how to pronounce it. <laughs> yeah. Um, in Fukuoka. We currently how do you pronounce it Fukuoka. 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 We currently don't have a SIM card, so we need to find one of them. Um. At the moment, we're just blind wandering down to a 7 Eleven that I know is down here somewhere. That Joe definitely <laughs> didn't go to last night. <laughs> yeah. And. Yeah, and then, well, our plan for today is to go to a park to see the cherry blossoms, which are hopefully out. Well, I've just seen a cherry blossom tree, yeah. so we should be out and about. And uh, then we're going to the Kirby Cafe later yes. on. Which, to get a reservation there, I did have to book in advance, um, but the one here had loads more slots than, well Tokyo was just, you just could not get in the one in Tokyo. Um, I didn't even know they had one here but I just looked out of interest I thought oh that's not the first place we're going to. Yeah. So I managed to get us a slot with the one, it's like Hacker, Hacker or something. Yeah. Um, I need to really get better at pronouncing names. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to find a SIM card has not worked. No. Um, nobody seems to be selling travel cards so we might just have to get an eSIM. And seeing as we're going to the Kirby Cafe in well, a few hours, four hours, uh, we yeah, didn't want big food. So we've just gone to 7-Eleven again. We've got some rice cakes. And some chicken. And some chicken. Yeah. Nice? It looks nice. It's fried chicken in lemon oh. sauce. I'm also, yeah, just weird something. Um, I haven't got Wi-Fi to tell you what it came to. So we've spent about an hour walking around the shopping centre trying to find the subway. Admittedly, we did do a little bit of shopping as well. But we're finally on the right track. Just pulled out Kirby with a chef hat.
to detail is so cute. Yeah. Oh, it really is so nice. Yeah, Lauren had a tomato and it had a little M drawn on it in glaze. And a, a tomato about this big, so. Probably a bit expensive, but it's very cute anyway. Yeah, it came to, so we didn't have any drinks and it came to 45 pounds. <laughs> yeah. Um, but that was, that dessert thing at the end was like 12 quid. Yeah. And we just thought, you know what, you only eat it once. The, the burger was like 12 pounds. Just that tiny little soup, shot of soup <laughs> it was, was three pounds. Pound. And how much was yours? About uh, seven? Yeah, not, not a lot anyway. But. Um, we enjoyed it. It was very nice. Yes. It was cute. The attention to detail, to be fair, is amazing. So you can see what you pay for. <laughs> and everyone's so lovely. Yeah, and that as well. <laughs> and you get to take some stuff home with you as well. Yes. Like little lunch boxes and little things like that. So you do get like souvenirs out of it as well. Mm -hmm. 